welcome to the kitchen. I'm working on a beef with black beans. Hey, it's very simple and easy to do. That's why I love stir fries, because they are so simple. I've started off with a beef tip roast that I've thinly sliced, and then I have velveted it. Velveted it. <laughs> There's a good word for you. And by doing that, that's that style of the Chinese meat when you taste it. It's so nice and tender and delicious and wonderful. Has a little baking soda, cornstarch, some sesame oil, soy sauce in there, and a little splash of vinegar, salt or black pepper as well. And then I've just mixed that all together. And then this actually has been sitting for about 30 minutes, and that's exactly what we want. Do you see the smoke coming up off the wok? That's exactly where how hot you want that to be. And then I'm gonna add that beef right into there. And we're gonna cook that for, oh, just a couple of minutes, because you want it to be about 80% cooked. And the nice thing about beef, you can cook it rare and it's not gonna hurt you at all. Poultry, different story. You always cook poultry full cooked. Beef is another story. So once you get that all cooked into there, about 80%, we'll remove that out of there and we'll add the veggies into it and saute those around. Let me tell you what I've got for the veggies. So I have some uh, snap peas or snow peas here, whatever you can find at your store, bell pepper, ginger, onions, some green onions in there, as well as, uh, that's about it in there. And so this now, as soon as this is all done, is gonna go in here, gonna get sauteed, and then we're working on the black bean sauce when I come back. I have my black beans here. I have a mixture of oyster hoisin sauce over there, a little bit of chicken stock in there, and some cornstarch. And we come back, I'll show you how to put that all together. This is really good, delicious, and just bring a smile to everybody's face. No kidding, that's the yeah. trick. I'm already yeah. smiling. Working away here, guys. Oh, well, you always are. <laughs> <laughs> Let's finish it up here. So I've added the black beans into here, as well as the sauce that I talked about earlier, the soy, the oyster sauce, a little chicken um, stock in there, and then the cornstarch, and thickened it so you can see it thickening. To this now, I'm gonna add the veggies, which I have already stir-fried. So I did those when you weren't watching, and I'm gonna just give those a little toss in there and oh this smells so amazing and then here's the beef that I did earlier and we'll just add that all into there and we'll just toss this all together so that everything is coated nicely with the sauce the black bean sauce and so very simple this is the nice thing about uh, stir fries honestly this came together if you have all your ingredients together it literally takes about 10 minutes and dinner's ready this is a great way to cook. I love the wok. And now I'm just kind of using my spatula to fold everything together in there so that it has a nice coating of that sauce. Now the other thing, I did use black pepper on this. In the recipe, I think I have white pepper, which is traditional, but I didn't have white pepper. And I didn't want to spend, you know, $5 on a little thing of white pepper. So I just use black pepper. And you can do that absolutely at home. Now I'm going to serve this up. I have rice over here that you can serve it up with rice on the side, however you want to. It's just a really quick and easy, delicious idea for dinner. And look how many colors. Uh, that has on there. And the nice thing also I like about stir fries, the vegetables aren't dead. They're nice and uh, crunchy still. They have flavor to them. And it's just a, a great way to serve them. Okay, let's just finish that one right there. And you all take a look at that, how beautiful that is. Serve that up with some rice. And oh my word, you have a gold star winner there, guys. Head on over to KUTV.com for the recipe. You can also go to my website, cookingwithchefbrian.com. It's the featured recipe today. And grab it and have it for dinner, guys. That's fantastic. Good. Yeah, that sure mm. is.